Okay, um, welcome to my weekly app review. The first application we'll be taking a look at is Swift Key X. Um, it's a keyboard um, application. This is the trial version. Um, if you want to get um, the full version, you can. It's available from the marketplace. Um, I'm just going to take a look at. I just want to show you some of the layouts, the different design keyboards. They got the dark, the light, and the neon. It's going to show you the neon first, the light, should I say? And it's going to go to memo. It's going to show you the keyboard. That's that's how that's how the design is. It looks very nice. It's e nicely spaced out. It's going to test it out. And as you're typing, it does get it accurately, and it does have like um, it tries to predict the word that you're gonna try and do. Um, say, for example, you get the wrong spelling, it automatically correct it. But the keyboard's very accurate. You know, if you have a phone and you're not really happy with the keyboard, or you're not comfortable with it, or you're not typing as fast, you could try this keyboard out and see if you like it. Um, you could get this free from the Android Marketplace. Um, like I said before, this is a trial, and if you want the full version, you have to pay for it. Okay, the next application we're taking a look at is Third Blade. Um, basically, you're a guy running about and you just have to try to kill these slug type things. There is a story mode and there's just, um, different levels to play through. You can get like combo hits and stuff. And you have like a health bar and you have um, like potions to regenerate your health. The game is okay, but it does get a bit repetitive just doing the same um, actions all the time. But you know, there's a good story mode and I'm sure there's other stuff that you could um, unlock throughout the game. And you can get this um, free from the Android Marketplace. The next application we'll be taking a look at is All Recipes. Um, this is if you're, you know, looking to cook different um, things. Say for example, you could choose from any of these categories, appetizers, bread, breakfast. So if you want cookies, you can actually lock this in place. Um, let's pick grains and you could just spin it and it spins the bottom one because you lock these two at the top and you could just tap there to view matches or you could just um, unlock them and it randomly picks one from any category and then you just click and then it starts to um, find all the different recipes from what you chose appetizers fridge toast you just tap on it wait for it to load up when it loads up it has a picture, the name, the ratings and it shows you all the ingredients and the directions um, instructions how you would uh, cook it and you could also read people's reviews as well, there's 88 reviews you can see um, the uh, 3 stars and you can read people's comments so you know if you want to try it or not you could also submit reviews as well um, this application is great for you know finding different food or if you're just looking to cook different things Next application we take on a look at is drop. It's very simple. You just have a ball that's very bouncy, and you just have to keep dropping it through the slots. Um, as you progress further, it does get a bit faster, so you need to be um, putting the balls through the hole a lot faster. You do use the accelerometer to steer the ball, and the ball can be very bouncy, which makes it a little bit more difficult to get it in the holes and get it accurately. You do get points at the top. Um, left hand corner you could see it's a really good application you know just to kill some time and you could get this free from the Android marketplace okay so the next application we're taking a look at is Jules Maze um, this game is similar to be Jules you just have to match three or more in a row um, so we got here you just have to use your finger and swap it down and match three or more very simple game um, it's a little bit different to be Jules you just have a little bit more features and you do get like these bonus jewels that do a lot more damage um, it's a really nice game I've been playing this for a while it can get a little bit addictive after you, when you start playing it um, you can pick this up free from the Android marketplace okay so the last thing when we take another look at is the live wallpaper the live wallpaper I'm going to show you is let's get it opened up autumn live wallpaper it's similar to another one I showed you before, I think it was Eastern level paper or something like that. Um, but instead it's just um, have like autumn trees, you know September now so I was getting into autumn. Let's get that loaded up so you can see. It's a pretty, pretty nice wallpaper if you're just looking for a change, you know. Um, another thing I want to show you, you get two um, wallpapers this week. 
It's falling leaves like wallpaper. It's very nice. It does basically what it says. It's falling leaves. You just have leaves falling in the background. I think you could interact with them by tapping them. Not really sure. But anyway, it's just a nice wallpaper. You're just looking for a change. Um, that's about it for that review. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. Follow me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter as well. And that's about it. Thanks for watching. Different features there that I did, you know, to make it a bit different from B Jord. Wow, really, really. I'm trying to do a review here and you're just interrupting me.